Hi, I'm Alan Whiting from Outback Travel Australia. Today we're in our little camper where it's cosy. It's very windy outside and cold but nice and warm in here. And we're talking lithium batteries with Cheryl from Revolution Batteries. Aren't we Cheryl? Yes we are. G'day Alan. How are you? Very well. Five years ago you sold us on the idea of a lithium battery for the camper. 11 kilos of battery weight instead of 44 and the promise of better reliability, quicker recovery with solar charging every morning and it's been fantastic. We haven't had a moment's trouble. The combination of the Revolution 100 amp hour lithium battery and the Red Arc Manager 30 BMS system never had a problem in the bush since. We hear that regularly and are happy to hear that. I'm sure if there were problems you'd be hearing about Absolutely. them. Because Absolutely. Because if things go wrong with your electrical supply when you're camping it's big trouble. And we've, we've been away and we've had fridges fail or wiring trouble and it's an absolute nightmare. You've got all your food supply, electrical problems you don't need. Yeah. And warm beer in particular. Yes. On yeah, a that's, hot day is that's very, not, very bad. doesn't make no, happy campers. Bad thing. <laughs> well, we find, I monitor it because the the Manager 30 has got a beautiful display screen so every morning I monitor what's happened overnight. So we've been camped up, we've had the lights on, the fridge is running all the time of course and we've got a um, 200 watt solar panel but overnight naturally the battery drops. Typically in the morning it's between 75 and 87 percent and a couple of hours sun in the morning, bang, it's back up. Yep. Yeah. Lithium loves solar. It absorbs the full output from the panels. So with your 200 watt panels, you're putting in about 10 amps in peak sun and covering, you know, more than covering your fridge and recovering quickly, as you said. Yeah, and we've found also, we've been to campgrounds where we plug into their mains and even there, the Manager 30 will put solar into the battery before the mains. It'll prioritise solar. Yep. So it's trying to save you money all the time. Absolutely. What a great product. <laughs> <laughs> Our initial reaction to the price of lithium was, you know, can it be that good? And we, we'll camp up for a week, 10 days sometimes in cloud on a dam and even in cloudy weather, the lithium battery just doesn't let us down. Yeah, even in low light conditions, it's surprising how much power is being put into the battery. Because there's low resistance in the cells, unlike traditional batteries where, you know, that 10 amps and peak sun or wouldn't be going into the battery. In low light conditions, it's even worse. And um, yeah, you can camp a lot longer. Yeah, we. We'd, I can't see us ever not having lithium. Yeah. Once you've had it, that's that's it. Yep. You're yep. locked in forever. Yeah, and when you add up, you know, what is it, 40 bucks a night for a powered site, if you're camping regularly, you can pay for a lithium battery, um, you know, within a couple of years. Yeah, that's a good way of looking at it. Mm. Well, the life we've had, there's been no deterioration in the battery at all. I thought there would be because that's what you get with with typical lead acid battery, is that when the thing's three or four years old, it'll drop more overnight and take longer to pick up. And it never seems to get a full charge. No. Even with the alternator running or when you put it on mains, whereas the lithium battery, doesn't seem to have suffered at all. No. It's, it's, it'll be a hundred percent after a few hours driving or a few hours sunlight. Yeah. And it's the, the quick recharge is, is probably one of its best features aside from being lightweight and longer cycle life. 
Um, with a lead acid 100 amp battery, you know, you're looking at 10 to 12 hours to fully recharge it. And that's at about 60% depth of discharge. And you're never driving for that long. And you're never putting, well, not often putting 30 amps of solar back into one 100 amp battery. No. And then you get the sulfation and yeah, you yeah. don't get that 100 amps anymore and it's just a vicious downward spiral. Yeah, well on this last trip, um, we got back home and um, I noticed there were some intermittent electrical issues. So I took the vehicle up to the auto electrician and the vibrations had caused some connection problems and also the starting battery has just had it. The plates have just shaken to bits. <laughs> uh, the bush roads now in the Northern Territory, Western Queensland and WA are really corrugated so all that vibrations going in yeah. doesn't seem to worry the lithium battery at all. Yeah. If it's constructed properly it's yeah it can withstand those conditions. But there's lithium and lithium because we've come across some people and they're surprised that we've had absolutely no issues with the revolution. Some other brands don't seem to be quite as reliable. No, we've, we've got a premium product and um, it's been field tested with yourselves and um, you know our other customers who go out bush and um, yeah, it's a reliable quality product and we've got batteries in the field for, for 10 years um, and the original batteries still in campers and four-wheel drives all going really, really well. So we're very, very proud of um, our history and the pedigree mm. and, and the happy customers that we have. Well, I couldn't believe it. My brother still got the first buck he ever earned. He's a plumber. <laughs> you know how much money yeah. they make. And he bought three Revolution batteries for his caravan. Mm. Cost him a fair bit of money, yep. but he didn't even complain. No. After he'd tried it with two, he thought, a bloke needs even more power, and he bought another one. Yep. And he hates spending money. And he would never trust you. Definitely not. <laughs> no, we, we, uh, we love our Revolution lithium battery and everywhere we've gone people are surprised at the way we just squander LEDs and fridge time because it's not a problem for us at all. Yep. Fantastic. <laughs>